Bro, grab your hand like this right now and slap the fuck out of you. If you touch your phone whilst you're working, because you're a fucking retard if you do that. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can easily get into a flow state. And just don't be a fucking loser, basically, not a fucking addict to your phone. Because when you are not, not an addict to your phone, you can actually work peacefully without that bullshit thought intriguing your mind. And that's what I want from you. Because right now, I'm pretty sure you're not even achieving your potential. So I'm gonna fucking teach you how to get into a flow state. All right, let's get into it. First thing, you need to wake up, take a cold shower. It doesn't matter, you don't need to be a fucking pussy. Make sure you wake up and take a cold shower. I don't wanna listen any excuses. I don't wanna listen any excuses, okay? You need to take a cold shower because it's gonna regulate your nervous system and also just gonna start like your dopamine. Increase your dopamine basically for the next three hours. That's so, so massive. And also, by the way, bro, if you stick to the end of this video, I'm gonna be doing the biggest giveaway I've ever done on this channel. It's also basically the first giveaway. So yeah, it kind of makes sense. So okay, make sure you take cold shower because it's gonna basically increase your dopamine for three hours, bro. Imagine three hours every single day in your lifetime. Like it, this is how your life looks like on the graph. If you take, keep taking cold shower every single day, yeah, fuck me. And the second thing is, you need to get morning sunlight. If you're not getting any sunlight in the morning, you're basically being handicapped. Cause doctor, I think Andrew Huberman says this, that morning sunlight is very, very important if you're not getting any sunlight. Basically morning sunlight starts your testosterone production, your serotonin, fixes your circadian rhythm, just makes you a healthy overall human being, you know? Why would you not want that, bro? Like, come on. And the third thing, so let's say you've taken the cold shower, you got the morning sunlight, and before cold shower, let's say you've done some breath work, right? You've done like Wim Hof breathing, or I don't know, fucking Tai Chi, Pranayama, or whatever. And you've got morning sunlight. The next thing we want you to do is grab some coffee coffee, meditate. When you combine these two things and then you sit down to work, you get into a flow state. Now, let's talk about how to not fuck that flow state up. Make sure you don't look at your phone. If you're a fucking addict to phone, make sure you turn it black and white. If still that doesn't work, I bet you have your notifications on because you're such a fucking pussy that you don't respect your time. So make sure you switch off your phone and throw it in another room. That's what I do. I fucking switch off my phone and keep it in the kitchen here. So make sure you do that. It's gonna help you so, so much. So make sure you do that. And then another thing you can do to stay in flow state while you're working, just enjoy the stuff that you're doing, bro, basically. If you're doing some work that you don't even enjoy, like whenever I record these videos, I get into a flow state, I'm having fun. I'm having a blast. I'm just fucking screaming at you, dumb guys. <laughs> Sorry, bro, don't feel offensive. But yeah, that is gonna help you get into a flow state. And by the way, bro, I cannot believe so many people struggle with getting into a flow state or with their basic productivity. That's why I provide personal productivity coaching. It's the first thing in the description below. We'll quickly hop on a call. We'll see if we're a good fit. We vibe together and we'll see how it goes from there. So for, make sure you click on the link right now. It's the first link in the description. Go, go click on that right now. All right, what's the next thing? So you're being a flow state, you're doing everything. Now, maybe you have loud roommates, maybe you have like parents who just annoy you, you know, out of nowhere. So what we want you to do is just let them know, like, when you start your task, just let them know beforehand, like, oh yeah, mom and dad. Or, hey guys, like roommates, just let them know that, oh yeah, I'm gonna be working, so can you please like keep it down a little bit? Like they'll fucking appreciate that, that you already let them know. They're gonna be like, oh yeah, yeah, for sure. Like, I don't know why guys are so shy, like so timid to just ask for like basic stuff. <sighs> so fucking weird. Ooh. 
I do have like more stuff that I can teach you. Let me see. Okay, so low carb carnivore, I'm pretty sure you already know about this if you're in the self-improvement space and you're watching a video like this. I'm pretty sure you already know about the low carb carnivore. So basically carnivore diet is meat only, your brain is sharp as fuck because carbs fuck up your brain. Hopefully you know that. And Tim Ferriss says 20 minutes of meditation every single day. That's the thing high performers do, DHA fish oil. Huberman recommends that. It's very, very good for your brain. I take I take fish oil personally, and I see a big improvement in my brain now. Gut microbiome, you need to have some superfoods, maca, royal jelly, colostrum, marine phytoplankton. There you go. These are the four superfoods you can try. They improve your gut microbiome and like basically all they'll detoxify you as well they'll improve your dopamine as well fuck me fluoride toothpaste avoid fluoride toothpaste it fucks up your productivity i know it doesn't sound much but it actually clogs up like your spiritual realm yeah i guess that's all for this video i hope you found well in this video bro sorry i was a little hungover last night i went out a little hungover in this video, but hope you found value in it. And again, I do provide personal productivity coaching and you will not look back. You will not regret taking that coaching, bro. So it's the first link in the description below. Make, make sure you click on that right now. And I'm a small YouTuber. Make sure you click on that subscribe button. Make sure you smash the like button, click on the subscribe button and do all that fancy stuff that YouTubers say. So help a small YouTuber out, bro, please. <laughs> And as always, there's some social work you need to do. Make it effortless. Take care. Bye-bye.